Hey Jeannie, welcome to Cocktail Conversations. Thanks for having me. You're a master of wine. Can you tell the audience what that means? So master of wine really depends on their personal background. And I come from a journalist background, which means that after I got my master of wine qualification, I wrote books. I have three books out now, communication, teaching, sharing, critiquing wine, more about education and consulting. Do you have a favorite wine memory? When I was still a university student and thought that all wines were just cheap jug wines, I had a 1982 Talbot which suddenly opened my eyes to the fact that wine could be like food. It could have multiple tastes and flavors. It could evolve and change in the glass. And there's history and culture behind it. So I'm on a date. How do I make myself look like a wine pro? (laughs) So one go-to grape that would impress um, a date would be to order Riesling, top Riesling from anywhere in the world. Great value, great acidity, crisp and versatile. What's your favorite destination to fly to? Paris. It's captured my heart when I was there for the first time when I was 13. And every time I go, it still takes my breath away. You're on a business class flight. What's your wine and meal pairing? I would definitely be having our champagne. It might be Charles Heitzig, Tatanje. We have so many on Rio. I would be having it with hopefully like some sort of nice uh, Asian flavored fish. It could be um, a garupa or it could be a cod. So I think that's a wonderful pairing. Favorite color? Yellow. Red or green grapes? Red. What's your comfort food? Rice with sunny side egg and soy sauce. Sweet or sour? Sour. Predictable or exciting? Exciting. Favorite country? South Korea. I was born there and I was there until about six years old. I have so many great childhood memories from there, so it's still home. Wine before or after food? After food. Favorite season? Fall. Great, Jeannie. Thank you so much for your time. We'd love to present you with your drink. It's a Jinja Sour. Mm. Very pretty. Red and yellow. It's delicious. I love that combination of the sour lime juice content and the color also. A little bit of yellow, red, I guess coming from a a bit of red wine on top. Mm. Cheers.